Hello Taurus, welcome to your reading. Let's take a look and see what Spirit has for you today. Welcome to Celebi Tarot. Easy does it, Taurus. Easy does it here. There's no need to hurry or force anything as everything is happening and occurring in a perfect time frame. All right? And use your inner wisdom. This is big. Use your inner wisdom with the situation. What has your intuition, your spirit telling you about this situation? There's something here that you've gotten confirmation on, right? And I feel like maybe for, for some of you, maybe you've gotten it already or maybe you haven't. But there's this energy of, I know exactly what to do. I know exactly how to move. I know exactly what not to say. I know exactly how to use discernment. I know exactly how to camouflage my way into this situation, okay? So there is a situation here that you do not need to rush, Taurus. You don't need to rush it. You don't need to rush clarity. You don't need to rush the truth. You don't need to rush someone to admit anything. Sitting back and using your intuition is going to be your powerhouse, especially if you're a Taurus moon or rising. You're going to realize that I already know the truth. Everything is right in front of me and I already understand what I need to do and I'm going to allow it to unfold naturally, right? It's like the FBI in a sense, right? They allow things to unfold naturally, right? And they just gather information, gather evidence, and then at some point they make a decision of what they need to do, but they never call it out right? Uh, they never give you any warnings of, hey, I know what you're doing or anything of that nature. They just sit back and use their inner wisdom or their computers. You understand what I mean, right? Um, but I do feel like for a lot of you, there is a miracle coming in here. Um, have faith in your prayers, right? For some of you, you've been actually, you know, wanting to manifest balance here. If you look at her pigtails, wanting to manifest balance, wanting to manifest a child, wanting to manifest a happy new beginning. Spirit is saying, have faith that your prayers have been heard and they are going to be answered. Some of you could be traveling or wanting to travel here. And I feel like it's, it's like, should I, should I do this right now here? And look how you're hiding. It's like you're, you're listening in or some of you could be watching someone right? You could be watching them online or you're watching what they're doing. You're watching their actions. You're watching their steps and something may not be adding up to you. You're like, oh, that doesn't make sense. Well, I'm going to let that unfold. My, my friend said that and that didn't make any sense. Hmm. All right. For some of you, you had to end a friendship as well, or you had to end a relationship because things just weren't adding up. You were picking up on someone's manipulation or you're picking up on someone's, um, you know, their, their, their desire to manipulate you, but it just didn't work in a sense here. What's happening with Taurus is in love. Anything else that we need to know? Look at you searching, searching for why, wanting to know when, why and when here. Someone here wants to know when you're going to contact them. Someone here wants to know when you're going to reveal your emotions to them. Someone here is very curious about your next steps. What are you doing next, right? What do you know? What do you not know here? There's something about someone here at some point like abandoning you here or, you know, leaving you out of a group or leaving you out of the loop at some point here. Okay. Something was made very clear to you. And it's like, I'm not even part of this. Like, you know, I saved you or I'm always here for you. You literally obviously were, you were someone's like confidant. You were someone's light. And I feel like when it came to you, this person kept you confused here. And this person possibly would breadcrumb you. This person could be at a distance here. I will say for a lot of you, Taurus, expect someone coming in here with this like grand gesture, right? It's like this gesture of like, hey, I want to be part of your life. I really feel like it's one of those things where someone here, it's like they're trying to figure you out or trying to figure something out about you here. They don't feel, and if you look at this person's corset, their corset is not tight, right? Which means like, I feel like I'm losing a grip of this situation. So someone here feels like they're possibly losing a grip or they're, they're misplacing something or something's not adding up when it comes to you. 
okay some of you might find out that this person is in another relationship or there's something about another relationship happening here what is this person's intentions with taurus please what is this person's true intentions here wow what is this person's intentions moving forward what's going on with this person high priestess here this is someone that i feel like they worry if you love them back or they worry that they worry about the future a lot. Look at this person looking into this this ball, right? This crystal ball. It's like this person feels like they want to know more before they invest in you or this person feels like if I invest in you, would you hurt me? Or if I give if I gave you this commitment or if I gave you um, the truth here, maybe you wouldn't be the person that I inspired you to be. Like someone here has like a mindset of things shifting. They believe things shift a lot. And of course, yes, change is, is obviously important in life. But this is someone here that I feel like at times they don't trust themselves. They feel like they don't trust themselves. And this person could be getting readings or maybe you could be getting readings. But someone here doesn't trust the future. Let's get some more with this. The tower again. Is this something that ended already, Taurus? Or is this something that you realize has collapsed and you're trying to figure out the truth here? Someone also I'm hearing, it's like they want to know if you moved on or if you're creating bigger and better without them here. So someone here, it's like they're, they're digging. They could be spying on you here. Could be a Sagittarius, Temperance, Sagittarius, Scorpio, Pisces energy, Cancer as well. But it's like out of nowhere, this person starts pouring this energy of, okay, let's be harm, like, let's have this harmonious conversation. A lot of you, there's, there's a very ex unexpected action coming from your person. But Spirit is literally knocking on my brain and saying, please use your discernment. Please use your discernment. It's going to be very, very important for you to use your discernment when it comes to this person. Because I feel like someone here is going to come in and try to give you what they believe that you desire. But also still embracing that energy of fear. Like I'm afraid that you'll find someone better. Or I'm afraid that I'm too good. You're too good for me. Look how this person's viewing you. They're viewing you as like, you know, maybe you're too good for me. Maybe maybe this is not something that you really want. It's like they're guessing for you, okay? Or this person looks at your money a lot or this person is someone that could be um, in a place where it's like, I wish I was like you or I wish I had what you had. So you want to be very careful. This could also be friends, all right? That it's like they're your friends, but deep down inside they envy you. Just be very careful with that. Okay. Anything more, please, moving forward with Taurus? Anything that they need to know here? You have someone here coming in wanting to surprise you with a gift or wanting to surprise you. It's like they're trying to get on your good side. It's like someone here doesn't want you to... It's like, I don't want you to think I forgot about you. I know my actions haven't been the best, but I haven't forgotten about you. And this could be someone here that owes you money or maybe they'll try to like give you back your money just to get back into a good space or something that they owed you. Or maybe that they feel like, okay, well, I know Taurus likes this, so let me give Taurus this in order to surprise them. Yeah, like look at all these people coming up to your door we have like we how many of this we have people like showing up at your doorstep constantly you have one person showing up with a gift then you have another one hiding a gift but everybody's like surprising you here but i feel like it is very important for you to be very careful here right because i feel like i get surprised before i know what's in the box and what i mean by that is for some of you that are connecting with someone that you question, open the box first before you get excited. Because I feel like the box may not have what you think that you deserve in it. It's like, oh, I'm excited to see you. I'm so excited to see you. I'm so excited to connect with you. But what's in the box? A lot of you may open that box and might find it empty. 
So be very discerning. Use your discernment. Like, don't get excited because someone sends you a text. Don't get excited because someone's giving you empty promises. Like, open the box, a.k.a. what are the real actions behind what you're saying, okay? Because I do have someone here. It's like they're trying to, to, to fool someone. And this is why Spirit is saying, use your inner wisdom, Taurus. I will talk to you soon. Have a beautiful one again if you're interested in a personal reading. Everything is below. Have a good one.